The problems with Dallas area streets were made worse by a recent round of rain. Oh yeah, and we've had so many problems with that. <laughs> Steve Cruz are putting in extra work to fill up the number of extra potholes that have formed. Fox News' Alex Boyer is more the effort to fill them before the next round of rain. Hey, Alex. Hey, Clarice and Steve. Well, city crews are working 10 hour days to try to make a dent in the pothole problem that you said was amplified uh, by last week's rain. Now, more than 500 potholes were filled during the last uh, few days, and there's still plenty more, as you can see, to get to with more rain on the horizon. They're trying as fast as they can to get ahead of the forecast that calls for more storms Tuesday and Wednesday. 17 City of Dallas crews working day and night to fill potholes like these along Corinth Street and South Riverfront Boulevard. The once relatively small potholes made much larger by last week's relentless rain. Yeah, I mean, those three down here, it's, it's really bad. Edgar Galvez knows firsthand just how much damage a pothole can cause. He's driven through several in his South Oak Cliff neighborhood recently, damaging his suspension rods. They all keep doing it, the same thing, and the water stay there, and then when you dry, you feel the pumping on the side, and mm -hmm. I have my daughter, and I have my wife who's pregnant too, mm -hmm. so I try to go slow. This is actually steel that you see coming out, because the, uh, the tire is, is coming apart. At Dunlap Swain Auto Repair Shop in Dallas, the pothole problem is bringing in a lot of business. Well, you actually drop into the hole, is what you do, and when you drop into the hole, then the edges of the hole can rip the, the sidewall of the tire. Uh, they can also bend the steel of the wheel. Drops down too far, you can bend suspension parts on the front and rear of the car. According to the city of Dallas, crews are repairing about 175 potholes per day. During major rain events, they also mobilize 10 employees in public works to assist with larger asphalt repairs. The crews made a lot of progress Monday, but predict Tuesday's rain will reveal new problems. All the bumps in the road aren't yeah. helping. No, no, not really. No. And to give you an idea just how chronic the pothole problem is, these right here along Corinth, a city employee tells me they were just filled in two weeks ago and already they're in need of repair once again. If you have a major pothole in your neighborhood that needs repairing, you are asked to contact 311.